Hi everyone, in this video we will see how we can write and verify CSS selectors and XPaths in our Chrome console without using any third party plugins. So uh, let's get started. So here in this video what I am going to do, do is, first I will write both CSS selectors and uh, XPath for this password field and uh, later we are going to verify both CSS selectors and XPaths in the Chrome console. So let's get started. So uh, if you see, this is the format of CSS selector that is tag name, then we have attribute, then we need to mention the attribute value. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to write CSS selector for this password field. So for that, what I, need, what I will do is I will just right click, go to inspect. Here we have this uh, select an element in the page to inspect button. I'm going to select that. And I'm going to point it in. Uh, I'm going to point it to the input uh, that I'm go uh, that I'm going to write. Uh, so uh, this is the uh, tag for the uh, password uh, uh, field. So here, if you see, this is the tag name that is input. Here we have two types of uh, uh, two types of uh, what you say attributes. The first attribute is type. And the second attribute is password. Uh, you can use any one of these two attributes. Uh, it is better to use a unique attribute for here, for example, name. So based on this tag, we are going to write CSS selector for the password field. So uh, let's write. So tag name is nothing but input. We need to write opening and closing square brackets. Now we need to give the attribute, attribute name actually, attribute name is nothing but name. Now we need to write the value for that attribute. Here uh, the value for that attribute is nothing but password. So uh, this is the CSS selector that we have written for that, uh, what you say, uh, that input uh, uh, password. So what I'm going to do is in order to verify, uh, validate this uh, CSS selector, I will just copy this thing. I will go back to the Chrome. Here I, we can see this uh, console. So I will just open this console tab. In order to write, verify the X, uh, CSS selector, what we need to do is we need to write this uh, dollar symbol, opening and closing parenthesis. Inside this opening and closing parenthesis, we need to write the CSS uh, selector. Since we have already written the CSS selector for this uh, password field, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy in and paste it inside uh, opening and closing parenthesis. I will click on enter. So now it is going to uh, like after clicking on enter, it is going to uh, give that tag and this, parallelly it is going to highlight that tag in the page as well. Uh, this is about how we can write a CSS selector. Now we will see how we can write XPath for the same element. So uh, this is the format of the XPath. So we will write uh, the XPath for that element. Double slash, we have input, which is the type name. Now we need to give at the rate of uh, attribute. Uh, that is nothing but name, which we are using. And we need to give the value of that uh, attribute, which is nothing but password. So uh, this is the X path for the password input field. So what I will do is I will just copy this thing here. So in order to verify the, our X path in the Chrome console, what we need to do is we need to do, we need to write a dollar symbol, then X opening and closing parenthesis. Inside this opening and closing parenthesis, uh, and inside that uh, double quote, I will just copy paste uh, uh, that uh, X path that we have currently written and I will click on enter. If you see, it returned one thing and uh, it returned that input tag. And if I hover over this uh, input field, it is uh, highlighting uh, that uh, password input field. Uh, that's how we can verify uh, both CSS selectors and uh, X path in our Chrome console without uh, using any third party plugins. Thank you.